Now, Chandrayaan 3 is the third installment of the Chandrayaan series and it actually represents India's second attempt to achieve a soft landing on moon's surface. So far, only three countries have successfully landed spacecraft on the airless lunar world. Here's a report explaining the entire month-long journey of Chandrayaan 3 to the moon. Chandrayaan-3 spacecraft and propulsion module, having spent 34 days together, parted ways and embarked on their respective journeys on 17th August. The propulsion module separated from the lander while in lunar orbit. A day before, on 16th August, the spacecraft had successfully completed a crucial firing operation, placing it into an orbit of 153 kilometers by 163 kilometers around the moon. This marked the completion of the lunar bound maneuvers and brought the spacecraft one step closer to its ultimate goal of landing on the south pole of the moon. This is, it is a really a vital, vital element because uh, now you look at your Chandrayaan 3 mission basically consists of uh, uh, three plus one four modules type of thing. First is LVM3 which has taken the uh, composite of uh, Vikram lander uh, propulsion module and the Pregnan, the rover, uh, to the 36,000 kilometer uh, highly elliptical orbit. From there, uh, using a five uh, earthbound maneuvers, earthbound maneuvers, uh, propulsion module has taken the composite of Vikram lander and the Pregnan to the lunar orbit. Again, the lunar orbit also from the elliptical orbit, it has now brought to the near circular close to the moon, around 153 kilometer orbit, it has brought 153 by 163 kilometer. So now, uh, the important thing is, uh, fi final thing is softly and securely landing on the moon. The propulsion module is a box-like structure with a large solar panel and a cylinder on top. It is responsible for carrying the lander and rover configuration until the spacecraft reaches a hundred kilometers lunar orbit. The propulsion module will now continue its role as a communication relay satellite. Now Vikram has to take its own course of action. Further it has to separate. So even after, after separating, then the major event comes. The major event is uh, uh, four uh, 800 Newton thrusters. They have to fire to take it to the lower orbit. They, that also will be done in two steps and uh, ensuring that all the three systems are working properly. These two steps will go down, put 100 kilometer orbit, then from 100 to go to the uh, 30 kilometer orbit, 100 by 30 kilometer orbit. That's a very, very vital. But when it's going very closer, closer to the earth, so the position of the module has to be ascertained properly. Carrying hopes of billions of Indians, Bahubali rocket LVM-3 lifted off from Sri Harikota on 14th of July with Chandrayaan-3 aiming to land a rover on the moon's surface. The takeoff was picture perfect. More than a month later, it's now on its last leg to make history an Indian space dream come true. It's now a race to the moon. Chandrayaan-3 is all set to make a soft landing on moon's south pole on the 23rd of August. In fact, Russia is also aiming at the exact same place. Russia's Luna 25 is expected to reach Moon's South Pole a day before India's Chandrayaan-3 does. Here we have a majestic lift off of LM3M4 rocket carrying India's prestigious Chandrayaan-3. It's a race to the moon now. As Chandrayaan-3 heads to the moon and will land on August 23rd, there is another country aiming to land at the exact same place, the moon's south pole. Russia's Luna 25 took off for the moon on August 10, a whole 35 days after Chandrayaan-3 was launched into space and yet is expected to reach the moon a day before Chandrayaan does. So Luna 25 is taking just 12 days to reach the moon, whereas Chandrayaan is taking 40 days. But why is that? 
while Chandrayaan-3 weighs a whopping 3,900 kgs, the Luna 25 is much, much lighter, weighing just 1,750 kgs. That has made the biggest difference for the Russian moon mission. There are several other differences as well. Between the two missions, including the duration of the mission, which is one year for Russia versus 14 days for India. But does it really matter who gets to the moon first? It does not matter. It does not matter. And the, the, the competition is all in the mind of the media. So imagine, I think Luna 25 probably started development in 2012 or 11. And Chandrayaan started development maybe, I don't know, two, three years ago at least. So, and on that day, do you think these, both the scientists on both these teams knew that the other person is also going and we are going to land the same day and we're trying to, going to beat them? It is not possible. You know, these things take a lot of time. The reality is India will join an elite league of just three nations, which included the Soviet Union, to make a soft landing on the moon. ISRO even congratulated Luna 25 soon after their successful takeoff and quipped about having another meeting point in our space journeys. So let's be clear, Luna 25's moon mission most definitely does not take the sheen away from the Chandrayaan mission. Bureau Report, India Today. India's number one political reporter. Defines what seems to be happening, vendetta politics. Unmatched eye. Unmatched experience. The world has changed. My black hair has become grey as well. And with unmatched passion for the story. Do not monopolize the conversation. When it's 100% news that matters. It's News Today with Rajdeep Sardesai. Monday to Friday, 9pm. Only on India Today TV. India's number one political reporter. Defines what seems to be happening, vendetta politics. Unmatched eye. Unmatched experience. The world has changed. My black hair has become grey as well. And with unmatched passion for the story. Do not monopolize the conversation. When it's 100% news that matters. It's News Today with Rajdeep Sardesai. Monday to Friday, 9pm. Only on India Today TV. India's number one political reporter. Defines what seems to be happening, vendetta politics. Unmatched eye. Unmatched experience. The world has changed. My black hair has become grey as well. And with unmatched passion for the story. Do not monopolize the conversation. When it's 100% news that matters. It's News Today with Rajdeep Sardesai. Monday to Friday, 9pm. Only on India Today TV.